In this video, we're gonna learn an easier way to display multiple pixels on your LED matrix down here. So again, I have imported all the acquired library and I have also initialized the sense hat um, and called it sense. And I've created two colors, green and black. So um, what we can do, we're gonna use a um, command called, or a method called pixels, which means you can actually display a list of pixels. Um, Maybe it's best if I just draw it in here so you can see um, what I'm actually talking about in relation to that. So um, I simply say, right, image pixels, I'm gonna make a list. So to make a list, I open a square bracket. And then I'm gonna go enter. It takes me down to the next line. This is just white space. It makes no difference to the program. It just makes it easier for human beings to read. Now my first line, the first row of my matrix along here, I just want to be green. So each G is a pixel that I'm saying make green. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that's zero through to seven has been done. Now I'm gonna press enter. Again, it doesn't mean anything as far as the programming goes, but what it means is that I can now see that I'm down in the next row. And I also know that my next row, I want to be all green as well. Okay, so I've done that. Now um, I have saved the rest of it to clipboard. Um, you can see the next row is um, green, black, black, green, green, black, black, green, and works its way down. So I have the eight, um, or the, yeah, the eight columns and the eight rows. So the X values and the Y values all there. And it's all put in, so we don't have to worry about the coordinates and don't have to worry about the colors. So um, got a gray um, shading here, tells me I've got a bracket open, which is a square bracket, so I've got to close it up. And the next thing I now need to do is I now need to, um, display on matrix. Rightio, um, there we are. And so you see that I'm actually commenting in this one now. I'm trying to get into the habit of doing this, um, especially explaining different components of your program. At the moment, our programs are small. It doesn't really matter, but it makes it a lot easier um, for yourself and for other people to read when you're on a much larger program. So. The command we do to display a list or a matrix um, is called set pixels. So it's got an S at the end. Okay, that's really important. And then I've got to put in here the list um, image pixel. That'll do. Um, the list variable that are named up here. Rightio, so now I want you to have a bit of a guess and see if you can predict what is going to appear when I press play on here. So pause the program, have a bit of prediction, and then come on back. So uh, let's see if you predict, let's see how close you are. So I'm gonna run this, and we can see, hey, we have a creeper from Minecraft. So this is a little eight by eight creeper image there. Um, so what I want you to do is um, now take that code away and see if you can draw up some other um, eight by eight characters as such. Um, yeah, and so that's the end of all of our display videos. Um, and next we'll start looking at some of the sensors.